we are here in wolf city at uh, ramesh garu uh, land so came here to uh, look at the elevations and uh, logically give him some areas where to put ponds and where to collect water right so and and also where to place a barn or like a house that uh, that we want to put in so by looking at this land and the topographical like elevations that that was looked at using google earth and and other available information we like i i decided that put a catch like all the water basically comes in and collects at the wooded area it it goes by sheet flow and collects at the wooded area but you could catch each sheet flow areas and put individual ponds and we kind of decided on some locations i have it in the map and in the front it's kind of not different than what i saw on on a desktop evaluation there is a low spot at the front right where the the old entrance was so everything like all the water in this area like in the front goes and collects there and goes to the road so the best location for a pond like maybe around the entrance is the best location for a pond you can just put a small pond there and collect all that water and then to put like a house basically i i felt like the the area right in the middle there that i'm showing right there that's the best location because you don't have to elevate in order like elevate the ground in order to put a house so it from like in that area everything on the other side everything on this side at the back all the sides it just flows out by gravity away from the house right that's why we picked that so the other things the highest spot in this property is all the way at that corner and the lowest spot is near the pond where the wooded area is at the uh, at the uh, you know the elevation like where is the north here so this is north so that is southeast is so that is southeast so the southwest corner this is west actually oh. right yeah yes so west. this is east yes right so southwest corner is the lowest spot and the southeast corner is the highest spot so basically the whole site flow like if it rains all the water goes from the southeast to the southwest so that's that's on a nutshell everything but if we need a precise elevation and precise locations for a pond and precise locations and precise volumes of a pond we most likely need to do a topographical like a survey like you could fly a drone and get the topographical s survey what i would maybe i what i'll do from here is i'll probably go in and find the local tax or like like few times that the tax offices have their own like um, uh, what do you call like uh, the terrain models right so you could grab the terrain models in gis right and you can create contours right mm -hmm. i don't know if they have it in this in this area but i could i could go look at it if we have that then you don't need a topographical right if we don't have it then you probably need a topographical survey to to determine exactly where like you want ponds and what volumes you want those ponds Uh -huh. so, I, I think that's it. <laughs> Thank you.